were brothers. I guess some of them were married pretty much as I was, just simple ceremonies in the church. Yeah. But we did not have a, in fact, I guess Wellington didn't have many formal, big formal weddings. It was just a small town. Yeah. 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 That's great. <laughs> um, um, we, the re, living in Lubbock, I really quickly found there wasn't very much of a life for widows there. I played bridge and the first year there and played golf and swam a little bit in the daytime, but at night there were no activities for widows. Uh, and I guess that's how I got started back at school again. I, for something to do and because I was interested in a lot of things, I decided to get a master's in education. Mm -hmm. And about the first course or two I had, I switched over to psychology. And after about a year, they offered me a job. The psychology department was new and they didn't have many staff members. And they offered me a job as a teaching assistant. And so I worked and took a few courses along and just gradually, as a matter of course, worked up to a PhD, which never was a really dedicated course of study like students now who work for a PhD. Uh -huh. It was just sort of a gradual. I'm sure it was. <laughs> well, it really was. Uh, <laughs> I'm sure it and took I a really lot of feel effort. Like I didn't really learn like I would have learned if I'd gone off to a different school where I wasn't just sort of edging along. But I loved the, uh, yeah. <laughs>